right now we have received information solid information that the current minister of finance Honorable Msokotwane together with uh, the current minister of infrastructure and housing development Honorable Miluki have been appearing at the anti-corruption commission secretly initially when the call outs were sent to the two senior cabinet ministers they avoided going to the ACC so that they could be questioned and our sources are telling us that they are being investigated for having received $250,000 each from a named firm. That money was through a bank transfer and we know that uh, State House is aware of this investigation but we do not know why ACC is not updating the nation on where they are with the investigations. Fellow citizens and colleagues, we've also received very disturbing news that um, engineer Kutawala is involved in having transferred some amounts of money two days before his appointment as board chair through a bank transfer again to Honorable Charles Miruki. And the SEC are following up on this matter. He's also been appearing at the SEC, but they don't want it to be known to the public. We feel that the fight against corruption should not be done in secrecy. We as APNAT members and members of parliament are supposed to, in fact, work hand in hand with the SEC. So we challenge the SEC to tell us why a matter that they've been handling for more than two weeks is not being availed to the public. Information is being guarded secretly. We don't know, maybe it's the reason that the board chair of the SEC today, in today's News Diggers tabloid, said in the next few weeks you'll be seeing the current corruption fight. But we demand that the SEC should come out clear on Honorable Charles Migupi and Honorable Stumbekom Sokotwani. If the SEC does not tell us where this money came from, we shall name the contractor who transferred that $250,000 to each one's account. We shall name the contract. We have the information. But we are giving them a benefit of doubt to tell the Zambian people how far they have gone with the investigations.